Okay, hello YouTube, and I'll be showing you right now how to install the too many items in game inventory editor mod where you can pick whatever box and spawn them instantly instead of going into an inventory editor. So all you're gonna need is to download the current version. I'll provide the link in the description. So too many items mod right here. I'll provide the link. And also mine colony, which is pretty simple mod where you have practically servants that work if you give them the items needed. So you have a lumberjack which cuts down trees and replants him a miner that'll just mine. The delivery man that'll um bring the items from the miner and lumberjack and the farmer and bring them back to his chest. And so with these mods you're gonna need this mod loader from this site which I'll provide the link in which is mod loader beta 1.3 underscore 01 version 4. So let's get started. Okay, let's see. Let's get started. What you're going to want to do is type in the search bar when you press start, run, and open up this run program thing, I guess, that most computers should have. And this should be for like Windows and Vista and stuff. You're going to want to type in the percent symbol, app, data, and a percent symbol again. Crap. And press OK. And you'll come to this folder, which you can also access by... I'm deleting it so we can start new, just to show you. You can also open it by going to hidden folders, and it'll appear in your admin area or something like that. The way you can make hidden folders appear is going to control panel, switching it from categories to small icons, and clicking folder options. When you get to folder options, you're going to click view and find show hidden files, folders, and drivers, or drives, and click apply and OK. So now I'm going to get this from app data, and you'll see that I've deleted my Minecraft folder. And I have this custom launcher, so yeah, and we'll just update and download all the files for the regular Minecraft. And it's starting up. So I can just create a new world. See what I get. Let's see, I'm gonna remap my controllers and stuff. So I like my inventory as control, easier to reach for. Let's see where we spawned. Right here will be a good area to start with the mod. And I should turn down my volume. So let's start with the installation. So what you're gonna need is mod loader, one colony, and too many items. You're gonna wanna go back to the Minecraft folder, the dot Minecraft, and open up bin, right click on Minecraft, and open with WinRAR. And so you'll see all these folders that you'll probably never touch and modify, but right now, before I forget, you want to right click on meta dot or dash inf and delete it, because that'll stop the mods from working. So you're going to want to right click on mod loader, open it with WinRAR, take everything from here, drag it in here, click OK. Same thing with this mod, 
too many items drag or highlight all this besides the read me and drag in here unless you want to read it let's see what it says a lot of stuff okay this is all of that and mine colony open with winrar here just go ahead and do the same thing highlight this all and drag it in click ok exit out and that's done with installing it and since i have a custom launcher that kind of screws up sometimes i'm going to pause the video until it starts up okay i got the launcher up so this will be different and it started up and you didn't get that black screen so you're going to click single player new world that i've created or the game created and cows are moving and I don't think my controls okay. Never mind. So let's see. Now you get this screen every time you press control or the inventory button. You can click all these items. Right here are the mod items that have been added. So what you can do I'm just gonna spawn some wood planks. So this is how you're gonna have to make these boxes. I want to make a crafting table, bench, something, whatever you call it. Make some sticks. And this is how you're going to create a lumberjack box thing. I want to make a normal chest. Put a wooden axe in it. And you'll get one chest because you use a wooden axe. So the stone you'll get two and steel three and I'm not sure about diamond, but we can see right now. Diamond you get six lumberjack chests. And just to show you let's see where's stone. Your stone you get two. And with steel that's somewhere. And all of you are gonna see it and I'm not gonna see it and Oh, there it is. Three. And the cows are pushing me around, so. Place this down. Place it anywhere. But it's better to put it on a flat area because sometimes these people get stuck easily in holes. And so, when they run out of axes, they'll have a sign next to them saying out of axes, so you could just store them up with axes if you want to if you want them to keep working and so they'll work on that and you can't place two next to each other as you can see but you can place them in like a different area which is like a couple blocks away not a couple but you see at least this distance and they'll get to work and so if you destroy it all the items don't pop out they just disappear and the guy who's working disappears so that's how you make them and for the, all the other boxes you wanna you can do the same thing and just have it like this make a pick and make a chest and place the pick in the middle and they'll do the same thing but these guys are mine in an odd way but they'll get you stuff if you leave them there with a bunch of picks pickaxes and shovels and that's what they're gonna need pickaxes and shovels and they will have a sign that'll say if they don't have pickaxes or shovels and you can do the same thing for the um for the farmers you make a wooden hoe or some sort of hoe which isn't that kind of hoe, but the one you use for farming. And you place in the middle of a chest thing, and this is how you're gonna make a delivery man thing. You're gonna wanna make a crate, or not crate, but chest. Place it in the middle. And there's your delivery man's chest, and how this works is make a sign. 
this will be zero. Let's see, let's make some more few more sticks. And I'm too lazy, so I'm just gonna make a bunch of sticks. And so this works is you place the sign down. What they'll do is bring the items from whatever chest it goes to and and I'll bring it back to them. So one. And he'll walk there eventually and it, he will get stuck sometimes. And he walks straight back to his chest and brings back whatever he picks up and constantly walks back and forth. Right here, where's this guy? This can be two. And I should probably break that. Do do. Oops. So you walk there, pick up the items, run, or just walk all the way to the lumberjacks chest, which I placed as number two as the second spot, pick up all the items, and then he should. Uh, he'll walk back to his chest, or that chest, and walk back to the original one, or zero. And you can see he placed 15 wood, and the miner has seen... Sometimes they don't mine the actual items, so... Oh. But you get the idea of what they'll do, and sometimes they won't actually hit them. But I'm not sure if that actually breaks for them. I guess it does. So that's the end of the tutorial of how to install and kind of how to use the mod. And so this is a newborn disaster and please rate, comment, subscribe and leave comments asking questions if you need any more help. Alright.